Welcome back everybody, this is VTech and today I'm going to show you a very special video. So as you guys can see, this phone is the Samsung Galaxy S Blaze and this was my first smartphone. So I used it for about two and a half years and then all of a sudden the power button stopped working. So I had to take it apart and then I noticed the power button, the click, the little clicky thing, it, it wouldn't work. So I, it, I had to take it off. So then I started to find out how to turn on the phone without the power button. And the thing is, it's not like you, I have to open it from the lock screen. It was completely closed. So I had to find a way how to turn it on from its complete power off mode. So in today's video, you probably can guess from the title, I wanted to show you how to open an Android smartphone from the power mode. So first things first, this is connected to the computer with the USB, but before you do that, I'm going to disconnect it, and right here are the volume buttons, here's the power button, and if I can zoom in, it there isn't a power button, and there's no click inside the motherboard, so, and also here's the home button. So. What I'm going to do is first hold the power button up and then, the, uh, not the power button, I'm sorry. I'm going to hold the volume button up, then the volume button down, and then stick in the USB and then hold the home button. It'll take a while, but then this comes up. It says warning, custom OS can cause critical problems in phone and installed applications. So, it says volume up, continue, and then volume down, cancel, restart phone. So what you want to do is cancel and restart it. So, usually I press it and it takes a while to work, but it'll get there. So, it should work, and right now, it popped up. And it's actually working. So my phone doesn't have a physical home button but most Android smartphones should be able to do it there are some that might not be able to do it this way so I uh, suggest for you guys to look around on the internet and type up your certain phone that doesn't work but if you guys have a Samsung Galaxy S Blaze or any type of smartphone that's like Samsung usually this method should work I'm not guarantee guaranteeing it but it should be able to work especially on the Samsung Galaxy S Blaze so thanks for watching everybody be sure to like this video comment and best of all subscribe to our channel until next time everybody this is